Hi everyone, this is Lisa Montanero of Center Stage Success at lisamontanero.com. I want to talk to you this morning about um, a productivity hack that can actually fool you into thinking you're being productive, but you're actually procrastinating. I call it productive procrastination, but the name of the thing we do is called Clear the Decks. Now, I don't know about you, but when you're getting ready to start a big project, whether it's huge as in weeks or months, or whether it's even just a few hours, sometimes we look over at other work we have to do. Either we look at the physical work, the paperwork, or we go back and we look at our email, and we feel like we should clear the decks before we start the next project. And I get that. Um, I'm an attorney. I left my practice um, after the 9-11 tragedy. There's no bigger reminder of how short life is than looking out your office window and no longer seeing the Twin Towers. And I started this business um, on the heels of that tragedy in 2002. But one of the things that I brought with me to the rest of my career um, as a productivity consultant and success coach and speaker is this clear the decks. And the reason is when I was getting ready to work on a big case, I would feel like, oh my God, I'm gonna be stuck on this case for weeks and therefore I need to clear the decks of everything else. And so it can actually be a wonderful tool to use but it can also get in the way because what happens is you procrastinate. You clear the decks for hours and then the next thing you do, the next thing you know, you're supposed to be starting this big project and it's due, let's say, the next morning and you're starting it late into the evening. And you can also clear the decks for weeks on end. Uh, so I know some of you out there know what I'm talking about. So for all of you writers out there, you will write, um, you'll, you'll get to your manuscript, you'll get to your work in progress when you finish other things. And so you clear the deck sometimes for months, weeks, hours, days before you start uh, writing, before you give yourself permission to write. Uh, for any of you entrepreneurs out there, you tend to many things first before you work on uh, big projects or back-end operations or new programs. So let's talk about how you do clear the decks in a productive, proactive way so that you don't procrastinate too much. The key is to containerize it, to put it in a box and put a framework around it. And one of the best ways to do that is something that I'll talk about in a future video and it's called the Pomodoro Technique. And basically it's a wonderful technique where you time yourself. So clear the decks for one hour, get in there, get out, do the clear the decks, and then start whatever the other thing is you're supposed to do. If you're clearing the decks for an entire week before you start a big project, give yourself the week. So you get the hint. The hint, the point is to time it and to put a framework on it. And so what I'm gonna challenge you all to do your coaching challenge is to, when you do the clear the decks the next time, you find yourself doing that. Don't censor yourself, don't judge yourself. Let yourself do the clear the decks, but put a time frame on it. I'm going to clear the decks for 15 minutes. I'm going to clear the decks for one hour. I'm gonna clear the decks for all day on Thursday and then start the project on Friday, or I'm gonna clear the decks for X amount of weeks uh, and then start the big thing that I'm supposed to do. So that's your productivity hack. Clear the decks needs to be containerized. It needs to be contained within a time frame. Otherwise, it becomes productive procrastination. And some productive procrastination is okay, but a lot of it is not. Again, this is Lisa Montanero. Feel free to follow me on social media. Definitely uh, comment if you uh, know that you're also a clear the decks type of person like I am and if this is one of your productivity issues. Um, people always ask me, Lisa, you're the productivity expert. What are your productivity issues? This is a big one of mine and I have to watch for it. So go clear the decks, but clear the decks within a time frame. Okay, take care, bye.